back to my channel. Today I will be storing some of my Enhypen photo cards. Um, and if you guys are new to my channel, I collect Jay and Jungwon from Enhypen. Um, and yeah, I try to collect them as fully as I can. But if not, I um, prioritize Jungwon um, for my collection. But yeah, I believe it's been like over a year since I last posted a video. So I have a lot to store today. So it might take a while. Um, but yeah, I have photo cards all the way from Dimension Dilemma area, era until uh, Manifesto Day 1. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so before I start putting away um, Dimension Dilemma photo cards, I kind of want to update you guys on the rest of my collection. So I did kind of rearrange some of my um, like layouts since I didn't really like how I put everything before. So the new updates that I did was for each uh, album, I would put all their album photo cards for one concept and then uh, right after I will put the uh, Pre-order benefits or fan side photo cards that match that same concept um, Instead of doing like all album photo cards in a row and then all the pops like afterwards So yeah, that was the change that I did so I can do a little flip through of like what that looks like so this is Border Day 1 Dusk version, the regular album photo cards. And, oh yeah, and a thing I forgot to mention is I also collect Sunghoon um, for uh, regular album photo cards um, for most of the time, but if it doesn't quite like fit the nine pocket aesthetic that I like, I sometimes don't collect him. Like for their most recent album, Manifesto Day 1, I didn't collect Sunghoon because um, the album photo cards, I kind of had like four photo cards per concept, so it didn't really fit like the three pocket as much, so yeah, I didn't collect him this time, but yeah, for the previous eras, I did, so yeah, so this is Border Day 1, the Dusk version, and then here I have all the pops um, that are related to that concept. And then we have the Dawn version. And then the pops relate to that. And I thought it looked like more cohesive in my eyes, so yeah. And then this is kind of like the miscellaneous pops that didn't really fit the concepts of the other ones. Oh, and then another thing I changed was that I don't really put the bigger inclusions into um, my binder because I feel like a lot of the times the bigger inclusions aren't really uh, was it consistent in like their sizes and stuff. So it's kind of hard for me to store them like uniformly in this binder. So now I only store bigger inclusions that like fit the entire um a4 page or like um postcards that fit like an entire half of a page instead so like these or these postcards that i could like stack on top of one another yeah and then same thing goes for border carnival this is the up version, regular album photo cards, and then they have all the pops for Jungwon and Jay, um, then the hype version, and then I have a completed nine pocket page of teddy bear Jungwon, <laughs> and then here are the pops, and then I put a group photo card in the middle whenever there's a matching group selfie. Then we have the down version. And then for the down version, there weren't really many pops, so these are just the, the lucky draws. And then the group photo card in the middle. 
And then we have fever cards and broadcast cards. So I also rearranged everything for this album as well to fit like the concept for each one. So like the selfie, um, they're wearing the same outfit as the um, non-selfie photo cards. That's what I have for Border Hakanai. And same for this. And then these are the lucky draws. More uh, fan sign benefits. Some flyers. And then we can now get started on the rest of the albums. So I did uh, lay out like all of the pages um, uh, already, so it'd be a little faster. Um, so first I will start with um, Dimension Dilemma, the Skilla version. I'm sorry if I'm <laughs> mispronouncing these, um, but yes. So let's see. Here, photo cards. Okay. So these are all the regular album photo cards and the essential version photo cards. So this is Jay's. It's the hollow. Then the essential version. Then for Jung Wan. So, I usually put Jay at the top and then Jungwon in the middle and then Sunghoon at the bottom. And I like doing like having the selfies on the outside and then the non selfies down the middle. So, yes, this is the first page. And then now we can move on to the Pruto Benefits and Fan Sign cards. Um, so, let's look at these ones. Okay. I believe this. These two photo cards are from Weaver's Japan. And then these are the transparent cards from Aladdin. And then these are. Hmm, yeah, I don't really remember where these are from. I think UMS, maybe? Most likely. <laughs> Uh, this is a uh, neighbor shopping live photo cards. And then this is the group card from the regular album. And then, so usually for Jay and Jungwon, I want to usually like put them like diagonally from each other or like right across from each other so I think this looks okay oh I'm sorry for the glare too the lighting today is not the best so it looks something like that
that looks okay at the moment. And on this page, we can do the rest of the Scylla cards. And I believe these are from Soundwave, maybe? And then these are from Power Station. Oh. So for these, there are only five little cards, so I'll be putting them in this layout. So next, as the Charybdis, Charybdis version. <laughs> uh, so yeah, these are just the regular album photo cards. Essential version. Drawn. This one's really cute. Um, and then essential version. Sunkoons. I love his shirt in this one. Essential version again. Oh wait, actually, before I start doing that, I want to put away the album posters since they are pretty big enough to be in this one pocket page. Now we can put away these cards. can put away these pops. So I think these two are from UMS and then this is from uh, YZY round two. Yes, 24 stickers. And then Shopee. And this is the album good card. And since there are two sets of selfie cards, I don't want to put them in the middle. Then these are Lucky Draws, uh, Broadcast Cards, uh, other Lucky Draws, and then the Group Selfie Lucky Draw. Top. 
Yeah. Looks good. And then that's it for the Curb This version. So then next are the Odysseus version cards. So the album. Essential. I really like this version because all of them are poking their head cheeks, which is really cute. Dawn's. I keep forgetting to put the pop-up photo posters. cute okay then the pops phantom benefits so these are the target exclusive cards uh apple music reverse global uh use you or yzy round one and then the group selfie Back of these ones look really nice together. Okay, and then we have these pops. So, uh, actually, these are the lucky draws for round two. Uh, Weaver's Global Benefits round two. Uh, and then uh, Lucky Draws round one. Then the group lucky draw. And since um, these don't really quite match with the Odysseus version, but this is like the last photo cards that I have for like pre-order benefits. So since they're kind of wearing like striped shirts as well in this version, I thought it wouldn't look too bad on this page if I put them there. Because I didn't want to make a whole new page just to have like two photo cards on it. So yeah, let's see if it looks alright. Oh yeah, and these are from Hype Insight. I forgot to mention that. So yeah, I feel like that looks that looks decent. I think yeah, I don't think it looks that bad. So yeah, I think that is 
all of the regular size photo cards for Dimension Dilemma. And then I know I just had to put away these posters. So now we can go on to dimension answer. And then let's see. So for this version, or so for this album, there were only two photo cards per version, and there were only two versions. But yet in the no version, so these are the two regular photo cards, so the Polaroid card, and then the selfie card, and then in order to fill like a whole nine pocket page, I also collected an extra, um, or I also plan on collecting an extra um, fanzine card or period of benefit for Sung Hoon as well, so for um, this yet version, I'm collecting, I believe this is uh the weavers japan period of benefit so i have j's and then these are jungwon's then sunghoon's So these are from Music Korea, uh, Lucky Draws, Hide in Sight, uh, Japan, UMS Lucky Draw, and then another group card. We can do the no version of the regular album cards, and then uh, for Sung Hoon, I also collected his Weaver's Global Benefit card, which I just bought, so it should be coming in the mail soon. But I do have a group photo card filler for now. Also for the no version, there are kind of like two different concepts or two different like outfits. 
So first I'll be putting away the concept that goes with this outfit. So these are from Target exclusive photo cards. Uh, I think these are the uh, YZY round one. Um, neighbor shopping live and Japan lucky draw. Uh, we reverse Japan lucky draw. Then this is the group card. Oh, although it doesn't really match this concept, um, I feel like it goes okay with the other photo cards. So. And then on this page, we have this outfit. So these are from Shopee. And Yes24. Uh, Lucky Draws. And then another group card. And these are the broadcast cards. So again, like the outfits don't quite match for these ones, but they're both wearing like black. So I think it's close enough. And then on this page, we just have all the other ones. So, Weavers round two. Um, benefit cards. So, these are like the cards from their music video shooting. So, yes. Then, Lucky Draws. These are, I think, my favorite Lucky Draws of Jungwon and Jay. Like, the colors are so nice. And also their fits are so cute too. And then we have YZY round two. And then just another group of a card. Alright, so that is it for Dimension Answer, and then we can move on to their Japanese album, um, I think it's called Dimension Sen Senku? Senku, and so yeah, I also do not collect Sankun for this album. So, I think I want to start out with these photo cards. So, for this Japanese album, there were six photo cards included in their um, uh, album jewel case. So, like for like limited A and B, and then standard version. Um, and then they also had two photo cards for their solo jackets. 
So these are, let's see, these, these cards are all the ones from their regular album. And then I wanted to put these two lucky draws together with um, this version since they're wearing the same outfit. So, yes. Mm, I want to do this. Maybe I'll put like, selfies in the middle. And then the cons or the non selfies on the side. Good. And the backs are all purple, except for like the lucky draws, which is which are a darker shade, but I think that looks okay. So and then I have these for the same concept. Um so yeah, these are the two solo jacket cards with the purple backs. Um, I think it's called the Gleam version. I also forgot to mention these are from the Tower Records Lucky Draws. And then they had more Lucky Draws. They had like um, transparent kind of cards, but also one of them were was like hollow. So like one version's hollow, one version's not hollow, but it's like the same photo. Um, so yeah, right now I only have one photo card of the hollow version for, this is the Weaver's Japan Lucky Draw, I believe. Um, and then for J, I have the non-hollow version, which came also from Weaver's Japan. And then these are stickers. Yeah, so I do intend on buying the non hollow version for Don and then also the hollow version for Jay. But right now I've been trying to focus on their most recent Japanese release. So if I have the time or if I have the money, for it, I'll probably go back and collect them, but for right now, I'm okay with just these. So, let's see how I want to set it up. Mm. I'll probably put these in the middle. These are just fillers for if I ever collect the other one, but yeah, that's okay for now. Next is the Spark version. So, this. Yeah. And then, so these are all the regular album photo cards, and then these two are the HMV Lucky Draws. Yeah. And then the backs of these are yellow, so 
looks nice and uniform. And finally, we have the other cards for this version. So the same thing, they had a non-hollow lucky draw and then also a hollow lucky draw. So this time I did get both of John ones. So the hollow, non-hollow, and then Jay's, I don't have any of his for this version. Um, and then these two are the solo jackets. And then this is the Weaver's Global Benefit. And I'm missing, so yeah, I'm missing two of Jay's lucky draws. And then next, we finally get to um, Manifesto Day 1. So for this album, they had so many photo cards. Like four photo cards per version. And then also 20 plus pops and fan sign cards. So I'm still missing some especially the uh yzy photo cards um or like the photo cards near the end of the promotion because this is also kind of when they announced their tour so i was also saving money for that as well um but yeah i do have most of them right now i did buy also buy some from mercari so they should also be coming soon in the mail but yeah, for now, this is the M version. So these two photo cards are from the regular version. And then they just have like an orange back. Um, and then these two cards are from the engine version. So they have like a little paint um, stroke, which I really like on the back. It looks so nice. And yeah, this is the group card from the Lucky Jaw that we'll, I'll put in the middle to fill in the slot. And then these are Jay's equivalents. Okay, so now we can move on to the other benefit cards for this version. So these two are from Weverse Japan. Uh, this is the broadcast card. Uh, the power station lucky draw. This time the lucky draws are like made of different materials. They're not made of like the PVC, like thick, thick material. So they're just like, they're a lot like flimsier than regular photo cards as well. So that was interesting. Um, and then these are from uh, Neighbor Shopping Live. And they're like hollow. I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> and this is from Yes24. There are also stickers. Okay, so next I'll store the D version. So these are regular photo cards, regular album, engine version, regular albums, 
Then the group lucky draw. So yeah, I am missing the two engine version concept cards, so if any of you guys are selling it, let me know. I've just kind of been putting off the regular album photo cards, so I feel like they're more common to find. Yeah, so that page have the benefit cards. These two are from K Town for You. This is from the Lucky Draw. This is the UMS card. I believe this is Target exclusive. Then the Weverse Japan. Then the stickers. Then they have. Oh! MKM PVC card. So I do plan on filling in the spot with a YZY card, um, but yeah, that hasn't arrived to me yet, so those are blank for now. Then we finally go on to the last version, which is the J version. This one's really cute. <laughs> this little tambourine. And so the only card I'm missing for this version is the engine, um, engine concept version for John Wan, the one where he's holding the mic, I think. other benefit card so this is a lucky draw the hype insight photo cards um I think this is Lazada round one a neighbor shopping life oh just kidding <laughs> not neighbor shopping life uh weaver's global the hollow card then this is Sonara. Uh, this is Music Plant. Uh, Weavers USA.
So now we can move on to the photo cards where um, they're wearing like different outfits from the regular album concepts. So these two are from Weaver's Global Creator Benefits. And this is from, so they also release like Weaver's version albums. So these are the photo cards that came from that. This is a Lucky Draw from Soundwave, round 2, I believe. Um, also a Lucky Draw from M2U, round 2. Um, also Weaver's version album photo cards. And from Lazada, round 2. Uh, Lucky Draw from Power Station. And yes. So on this page, I plan to put um, the two photo cards that have them in the school uniform and then have them in like this orange like uh, music video outfit. Mm. And then this last page for Manifesto Day One. So these final two cards are from their most recent Japanese album, Sadome, I think that's how you say it. But yeah, these are just the Weaver's um, global benefit photo cards. So yeah, I did purchase all of their album photo cards on Makari already, so that will be in the next video. So I'll just put these here for, no here for now. Um, so yeah, that is it for this video. I'll probably just do a quick flip through of everything that I just stored. Starting from here. So thank you all so much for watching, um, I should be also filming another video pretty soon or I'll try not to make it as long as like a break as I did for my previous one but yes, um, so I hope you guys have a great day and great holiday and new year if I don't post before then, um, but yeah, thanks for watching, bye!